Racing is frequently regarded as a man's sport, yet this is completely ludicrous. In reality, racing is one of the few sports in the world where both men and women compete on the same track. The Discovery Channel is recognized for producing famous TV programs, and Street Outlaws is focused on racing in Oklahoma City, which claims to have America's fastest streetcars. The race is open to both men and women, so today in this video, we'll discuss the Street Outlaws Lady Racers. But before that, please support us by subscribing to our channel and hit the bell icon to receive all the recent updates on your favorite reality TV stars. Only the finest of the best compete for the Memphis Street Outlaws squad, which is home to some of the most badass ladies in street racing. And here is the list of the drag queens of the Street Outlaws. Number one, Mallory Gully, AKA Money Girl. In the Discovery Channel series, the petite blonde may be seen awarding the drag race winners their winnings, but a little study will reveal that Mallory Gully is more than just a pretty face. Mallory is only 23 years old and is just getting her feet behind the wheel. Last year, she began learning to drive with the help of JJ and her father, Kenneth Gully. She took Ol' Heavy down the road for her first race. Despite the fact that she didn't win, she's eager to return to the ring and establish herself alongside Trisha and Precious. The Money Girl works for Gully Bale Bonds and Keg Towing in addition to racing. Mallory's favorite race car is a purple 64 Chevrolet she's nicknamed the Ugly Duckling. On the track, she praises Chelsea Day, a fellow female racer, as her inspiration. Number 2 Precious Cooper No one would ever doubt Precious Cooper's nickname of Queen of the Streets. Precious can drive anything right off the trailer, and you'll hear her yell, off with their heads, at the end of the street. The Queen has been racing since she was in her 20s. She made her reality television debut in the ninth season of Street Outlaws Memphis, where she beat numerous well-known racers, such as Chuck Seitzinger, Doc, and Big Chief, to earn the title Queen of the Streets. Puddle Jumper was her first automobile, but since it was wrecked, she's been burning down the road in any car JJ puts her in, even zip tie. Number three, Lizzie Moosey. The one to keep an eye on is Lizzie Moosey of the Street Outlaws. Lizzie is a rare combination of beauty and toughness, with a gorgeous figure that is a sight to behold. Lizzie was raised in a family where drag racing was a way of life. Pat Moosey, Lizzie's father, used to race, thus she was introduced to the world of cars at a young age. Her love for the sport became stronger as she grew older. Lizzie began racing at the age of eight, but she took a long gap before returning to the sport. She hasn't looked back since, earning a high career graph by winning multiple drag races, breaking records, and setting new record standards. Her television career began with the successful reality show Street Outlaws No Prep Kings. Lizzie became the first girl to win a No Prep Kings event after winning three races in a row. In the No Prep Kings circuit, Lizzie proved her worth behind the wheel of the Moosey 959-powered Aftershock Camaro. Number 4. Kayla Morton, a.k.a. No Prep Queen Kayla is a brave, brass-faced, tough-talking professional drag racer with 10 years of track and street experience. Her passion for racing runs deep and she has the determination to back it up. She spent her childhood in the garage, working on motors with her father Stanley, a former racer. Kayla converted her hobby into a job and now makes a fortune as a motor builder. She came upon the doorstep of Big Chief and Murder Nova, asking Dino for a car. Something wasn't right with the Midwest streetcars crew. Kayla turned up to drive the car into the list just a few days after the guys finished it. She's set on being the first female racer to take the top rank. 
1993 Ford Fox Body Mustang is the car that Queen slays on. Number 5. Trisha Day, a.k.a. Midget If we are going to talk about street outlaws' badass women, then we certainly can't leave out Trisha from the show. Patricia Day, a.k.a. Trisha, is an American street racer who is running in her 40s as of 2021. Trisha drives Heffa, a 1963 Chevy 2 Nova, but she's won races in practically every car in JJ's garage. Patricia is not only married to a racer, but she is also possibly the best street racing queen. She's a force to be reckoned with in the Memphis racing scene, where she is known as Midget. When she and her spouse race together, they are a powerful, formidable force. The couple, together with another co-worker, Precious Copper, form a powerful force in the show. So that's a wrap for the video. Who is your favorite Street Outlaws female racer? Let us know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more updates on your favorite reality stars.